Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and also welcome to a bonus video this week. I know we're starting a little bit differently today and that's because today, as the title suggests, I'm gonna be dyeing my hair at home. Box dye. I think I mentioned it in my get ready with me um, that I was planning on dyeing my hair but I mean I looked into it and I don't want to go through the hassle of bleaching my hair blonde and then dyeing my hair a fun color and then it getting washed out within like a week or two I think that's just it just seems very wasteful for me and I don't think that I can pull off blonde hair anyway like if it happens to wash out I'm stuck with blonde hair so I thought I could just get a box dye and try it at home and if it doesn't turn out as good as I hope then no harm done I'll just have the tint on my hair for a while and I'll still have my natural hair underneath if it happens to wash out here's the one that I'm gonna use it's the Splat's Rebellious Colors the 30 wash no bleach needed and I picked the uh, Midnight Indigo supposedly this one is best for brunettes in the back it kind of has a guide Basically my hair is way darker than the one on the bottom here, so who knows, maybe this color won't show up on my hair at all. This will be an experiment, I have done this before with a purpley one and it looked really beautiful. So all I'm gonna do now is just prepare, I've already changed um, my clothes and um, I just have to take off my makeup. I don't have Vaseline, I only have Aquaphor, so we're gonna try this and put it around my forehead and my neck so that I don't stain my skin since <laughs> tomorrow we're gonna be going to a wedding so that should be interesting hopefully I don't actually um, <laughs> stain my skin because that would be bad I'm gonna be wearing um, a sleeveless kind of like a low-cut dress I don't know whatever it doesn't matter <laughs> yeah tomorrow we have that wedding and I just thought that maybe I could match my hair with my dress I'm just gonna take off my makeup get ready and then I'm gonna have my husband come and help me Okay, so I'm done washing my face, so now I'm gonna put some of this stuff on and we're just gonna just jump right into it and um, I hope it comes out good because I only have, let's see, what time is it? 7.30 and we need to go to sleep soon. I have to leave this in my hair for like about an hour, so I just, I just wanna, I just wanna do this already before I regret it. <laughs> I won't regret it actually, I, I know that I will, I just uh, <laughs> cut and cue the music. Hey guys, I know that this is kind of weird. Um, I was actually gonna wait until I washed my hair again, but I think it's gonna take forever because since my hair is still kind of dripping with color and staining everything, I have to blow dry it whenever I wash it. So I thought that I could just show you what it looks like, even though like it's getting a little bit oily and I really, really need to wash it. I figured this is better than waiting even longer. I dyed my hair on Friday night, so it's been Five days since I dyed it and I washed it about two or three times now so I want to make sure you guys see it before I wash it again just in case more uh, dye falls out <laughs> or washes out so yeah I'm just wearing my hoodie so that I can do a reveal even though it's not as dramatic as I would like it to be but um, yeah I just want to show you what it looks like 
My hair looks so much darker. Hopefully in this lighting you guys can see what it looks like now. In certain lighting it looks a little bit darker. In plain sunlight it looks so much brighter and it looks so cool and very pretty. I absolutely love it. I don't know, in here it's looking very very dark. As I said, in certain lighting you can actually see like the blue hue and I've gotten so many compliments on my hair already. I love it. Everybody loves it. I think that it's just one of those colors that is like not in your face completely. I was telling my husband that my hair kind of matches uh, the girl in the picture here in the packaging even though mine's a little bit darker. Like I said, I'm in love with it. I've already taken a couple pictures with my hair and I plan on taking a few more. I really like this color for summer even though summer is for like bright colors but I really wanted to change my hair up a bit. But yeah, this is my hair now. Um, I love it. It's been a struggle when it's wet because it is kind of staining everything. But um, now that I've washed it a couple times, I feel like the dye is coming out less and less. I'm going to start trying to use the hair products that I use because I was kind of worried that if some products made my hair a little bit damp, that my hair would basically stain my clothes. So I've been kind of staying away from that. I've only been blow drying my hair and straightening it if I need to because my hair does get frizzy. I'm really, really happy with my hair and um, depending on how long it takes me to wash it out, um, I may end up trying uh, green if it's not too close to fall. I hope you guys like this bonus video for this week and um, yeah, like and subscribe and uh, I will see you guys all on my next video.